there are several installments in the Disney Sing Along Songs collection of all time favourites, and I was really looking forward to these. And I am still looking forward to the others, but the early years is one I was very excited for because, as I'm sure most will agree, the early songs are some of the best. And it's a pretty decent collection. This was released originally in 1997, and as always, I will go through the songs and share some thoughts, but what I will say is that the variety is brilliant. There are some songs in this that I think we could guess. It actually might be quite fun. I wish I'd done this. I hadn't, but before you watch it, it might be quite a fun idea to guess which songs you think will feature. I kind of wish I'd done that, but certainly I think a couple of these I would have guessed, a couple not so much. There are some from films that are certainly classics, but some unique song choices. So I will go through the songs now and share some thoughts, but I think it was a, a really good selection and a couple of songs I didn't love, but that's more so just because they're not as nostalgic to me rather than there being anything wrong with the songs. But as I go through these, um, I think you'll find that there's a, a decent variety. So we start off with Zippa Dee Duda from Song of the South, which is a brilliant song. And then we have Give a Little Whistle, from Pinocchio, which admittedly I listen to a lot, but the Doris Day version, which if you've never heard, is gorgeous. But it was nice to see the Pinocchio version as I hadn't seen it in quite a while. And then we get Whistle While You Work from Snow White, which I think is one that I would have mentioned as being in this if I were to guess. Certainly I expected Snow White to be in this. And we also have Who's Afraid of the Big Bad Wolf from The Three Little Pigs, which is a brilliant song. It's not one that I would have guessed, but it works really well. And I love, I love the animation for this. I love The Three Little Pigs. They're so cute. We then have Casey Jr. from Dumbo. I would have guessed Dumbo to be in this, but I wouldn't have guessed that song. But I don't mind it. It's not a bad one. We then have the Merrily song from The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. I'm not bothered about the song. I'm not that bothered about the film. I don't dislike it, but it's just not one of my favourites. So I can take it or leave it. We then have one that I was kind of excited to hear. And this is Little Wooden Head from Pinocchio. And I, I don't remember this song. I've mentioned, I think, in other sing-along discussions that I haven't watched Pinocchio all of the way through in a very, very long time. And I just don't remember this song, but it's it's pretty decent. I couldn't sing along to it, but it, it's not bad. We then have Hi Ho from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, which is another one that I would have guessed would have been in this one. And it's it's fabulous. And it's it's impossible to not sing along with that one. I love it. And then we return to Dumbo with When I See an Elephant Fly, which is... Definitely a stronger choice than Casey Jr. I don't know which Dumbo song I would have expected to be in this most, but that one definitely more so. And it's a, it's a really, really good song. We then have The Three Caballeros from The Three Caballeros. And it's nice to have a bit of Donald in here because we don't really get a lot of the sensational six in Disney sing-along songs. Occasionally we get a bit of Mickey, but not so much the others. So it's nice to have that in there. And The Three Caballeros is not a childhood favourite of mine. I don't remember ever having seen it as a child. But as an adult, I rather like the characters and I like the film. We then get, we get a Snow White one that I don't remember very well. If you'd named this to me before I watched this, I wouldn't have been able to hear it or indeed picture it. But when it started playing, the memory came back to me. And this is Blubble Lubble Um Dum, which is tremendously fun to say. And I don't, I don't remember it very well at all. I did start to remember it as I watched it. But it certainly is one that I, I have no strong memories of. But it's, it's not a bad song. We then have another Song of the South which is Everybody Has a Laughing Place. And we actually have a whole bunch of Disney clips, Disney animations to display, well, various characters laughing, which I thought was a nice touch and it worked really well. So we actually get a wide selection of characters, uh, Shmee and Captain Hook and, and other characters just laughing together, which I thought was really fun. And then we end with When You Wish Upon a Star, another Pinocchio, of course, and a beautiful song. A magical song and a gorgeous way to end it. So I have to say it's a really great selection. Definitely had some films in there that I'd anticipated. A couple not so much. It definitely gave me some memories that I'd forgotten with Snow White. And it's made me realise I should probably I should probably go back and watch Pinocchio. I haven't watched it since I probably since I was a child, all of the way through. I have certainly seen clips here and there, but in its entirety, not in Maybe decades. 
which is kind of scary. So maybe I should watch that again, but I certainly enjoyed rediscovering aspects that I'd forgotten about. And ultimately, The Early Years is a really great sing-along songs, and I cannot wait to watch the others in the collection of all-time favourite series.